Hi everybody, I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Today I am going to be doing the TMI tag. I thought it would be really fun since y'all may not know a lot about me and they have a bunch of questions. I think it's 50 questions that you answer so I thought you might get to know me a little bit better and I've seen a bunch of people do this and I thought it was super fun so I'm going to be doing that today. So let's just get started because it's probably going to take a while. So I have got my iPad out and I'm going to be looking at the questions off of someone else's video because um, I just didn't want to be looking at my phone screen since it's really little. So let's just get started. Question one is what are you wearing? And I thought that I would show y'all my shirt and my outfit and my makeup. So first I'll just do my makeup really fast because I really don't want this to be really long and drawn out. On my eyes, I'm wearing this L'Oreal Hip Studio Secrets Professional um, Eyeshadow Duo, and this is in the color Electrified. It's really pretty. It's purple and like a frosty um, taupey shade. I love this. It's on my eyes. And for my blush, I'm wearing the Smashbox Blush in Heartbreak. And it's really pretty as well. And then for my lips, I'm probably wearing all of my favorite lip products. My lip liner by NYX in nude pink and the lipstick I'm wearing is the fig lipstick by by beauty and I'm almost done I've been using this since like August I think it's my favorite and I'm wearing my angel food cake NYX butter gloss for my makeup and then for my outfit I'm wearing this shirt that says New York City I don't know I hope that's in the in the screen but um, I got this at Forever 21, and I went to New York City in November of 2012, and I was so in love with that city. I want to go back, and I just thought that I would sport my New York City shirt today. And then my watch is from Swatch Watch, and I also got this in New York when I went. And then I'm wearing two of my rings, and then my earrings are also by... Forever 21, they're just gold hoops with some little diamondy things in them. So, question two, ever been in love? Yes, I am in love with my lovely boyfriend of five years. Ever had a terrible breakup? Um, I wouldn't say I had a terrible breakup, but I was sad, yeah. In high school, I had a few boyfriends, but none of them were like terrible like um I don't know I don't really know this is kind of awkward but no I have not ever had a terrible breakup like I was sad and stuff but now that I look back you know it's not the end of the world ladies question four how tall are you I'm about five five um sometimes I'm not, I would say five five I don't really know I haven't been measured in a while but I'm pretty sure I'm five five how much do you weigh um, I weigh about 137, 140, but I'm trying to lose a little bit of weight because my best friend's getting married in August, so we're on a mission to look really good in our dresses because she has a gorgeous wedding dress, and I'm her maid of honor, so I want to look, I want to look good up there too, so about that much. Um, any tattoos? No any piercings I just have my ears pierced and I used to have my cartilage pierced but um, I took it out to like clean it and then I couldn't get it back in so I was kind of sad but now I'm kind of glad that I don't have it anymore um number eight is OTP I did not know what this meant for like the longest time and when I google it like it started bringing up all this weird stuff and I was like okay obviously that's not it but OTP is one true pairing and I had to think about this for a while because I looked at these questions beforehand, but um, I would have to say that I love Hannah and Caleb off Pretty Little Liars, even though they broke up, but I think they're going to be back together, and um, Chuck and Blair, obviously, because they're just like perfect, and also I'm going to have to say um, Olivia Pope and Fitz off of Scandal, even though I know you shouldn't be cheating on your significant others, but they just have to be together in the end. I mean, they just have to. So, yeah. And then number nine is your favorite show. My favorite show is Pretty Little Liars and Scandal. 
I'm trying to think if there's any other show that I like. Oh, I like Castle. I love Castle. That's probably one of my other favorites. And then, um, my mom and I usually sometimes... She loves it more than I do, but she loves The Bachelor and The Bachelorette. And I like The Bachelor and The Bachelorette as well. But, um, yeah, I think that's all of my favorite, favorite band. I don't really listen to, like, bands. I like country music, and so I listen to, like, country. Like, it's just one person. It's not really, like, a band. But I love Luke Bryan, and I love Jason Aldean, and I love Taylor Swift and Carrie Underwood. I just like a bunch of country stars because I'm from Arkansas, so I love me some country music. Um, Eleven is Something You Miss. I don't really know. I don't really know if I miss... Well, I kind of miss my boyfriend because he moved away, and so I don't get to see him during the week. So, I do miss him. I guess that's it. I've seen somebody say that they miss summertime, and I do miss summertime because I so want to go to the lake and get to be summery outside and wear shorts and tank tops and cute summer outfits and sandals. I miss wearing sandals. So, I guess I miss summer and my boyfriend. Number 12 is favorite song. Um, I really have been liking, um, Doing What She Likes by Blake Shelton. I really do like that song, though. And I also like Luke Bryan's new Spring Break album, which I haven't listened to all the songs. I listened to a few, but oh my gosh, I like those. Um, let's see. She Gets Me High, I think, is one of them that I really like. I don't remember. I so okay. can't remember. How so. old are you? I'm 21. I told I toned, I turned 21 in November, November 5th to be exact. Um, hold on, I lost all my questions. Zodiac sign, I don't really follow the Zodiac thing, but I think I'm a Scorpio. 15, quality you look for in a partner. I would say they have to be, well, I think of my boyfriend obviously when I think of this stuff, but they have to be funny. And they have to just be sweet and nice and caring. Because you want someone to be nice to you, obviously, and want to be around you. And you have fun with them whenever you are around them. So I would say all of that stuff. Number 16, favorite quote. I don't really know off the top of my head. It's probably going to be a Bible verse, so I will put it on the screen somewhere whenever I edit this video because um, I need to think about it for a little bit. So 17 is favorite actor. I love Jennifer Lawrence and I love Rachel McAdams and I love Ryan Gosling. I'm trying to think. I love Matthew McConaughey. I love Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt. Duh. But, um, yeah, I think that's my favorite actors, actresses. Favorite color, I love red and pink. Those are probably my favorite colors. Loud music or soft? Um, I don't know. I guess, I mean, I don't like loud, like, head-banging stuff. But, I guess whatever I'm in the mood for. Where do you go when you're sad? Um, probably my room. I just go to my room when I'm sad. How long does it take you to shower? Well, if I'm just, if I'm not washing my hair, it probably takes me like five minutes. But if I am washing my hair, it probably takes me like 10 to 15, probably 15 minutes. I kind of take long showers. How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? I would say about, if I'm like getting ready to go somewhere, like somewhere important, it probably takes me like an hour and 15 minutes. But if I'm just getting ready to go to school, I usually don't wash my hair. Like, in the morning, I don't take, like, a shower. I usually just take my showers at night. I would have to say that it takes me about 45 minute, minutes. Ever been in a fight? Physical fight? No, ma'am. I have never been in a physical fight. I hope I'm never in a physical fight. 24. Turn on. I would say that's probably the same as the quality, um, whatever you look for in a partner. So, sense of humor, nice, caring, sweet. Obviously, they, I mean, looks aren't everything, but you want to be attracted to them. Turn off would be when guys brag about themselves. 
26th, the reason I joined YouTube. I joined YouTube, it'll be a year in March. This is March, so it's like almost a year. Ah! Um, but I joined YouTube because I just thought that it would be super fun to just make videos and tell other people, like, about my opinions of beauty products. I started watching YouTube for like the first time, I think in like 2012, like August-ish. And I was like, you know, I can do this because I just have loved makeup forever. And a bunch of my friends think that I, like I do their makeup and they know that I, um, I'm not trying to brag, but I do a good job on their makeup, you know. So everybody understands why I like to do videos and talk about beauty and hair and makeup and all that kind of stuff so I guess that's the reason why I joined YouTube and plus it gives me something to do because I don't have a job and I'm still at home in college so it's just fun to do videos and talk to y'all and all that good stuff and the next question is fears and I am scared of spiders I freaking hate spiders so much like I hate them a lot <laughs> I hate spiders and I also hate the dark. I'm scared of the dark. Well, like, not like if I'm in our room, like, and it's, you know, it's night or whatever, but like outside, I'm scared of going outside in the dark. And, um, I'm also, this is like super weird, but I'm scared, or it's like a fear of mine that I'm gonna have an accident and like flip my car over in a ditch where there's water. And then you like I couldn't get out and I would drown and I don't know why I'm scared of that because it's most likely never gonna happen 28 last thing that made you cry okay I thought about this before I did this video and it was Tuesday and I had to go talk to this lady about something for school and she was so rude to me and she acted like I was so ignorant for asking her a question and by the time I left talking to her, I was so mad that I had tears in my eyes. And I hate that I get mad whenever, um, or that I want to cry whenever somebody makes me mad. But that's what happens. And I hate that I'm like that. But I can't help it. So that was the last time I wanted to cry was when that lady was so rude to me. Last time you said you loved someone. That was this morning. Uh, my boyfriend texted me and said, good morning. I love you. So I said, good morning. I love you too. And then um, meaning behind your YouTube name. Well, it's obviously self-explanatory beauty because I like beauty and Natalie Ann is my name. Question number 31 is last book you read. And the last book I read was for school. It was for, for one of my classes, one of my literacy classes. And we had to read a children's book and do like group circles and stuff because I'm going to school to be a teacher. And so the last book I read was called Dead End on Norval Road, I think. It was like a children's book. It was kind of long for a children's book, but it had big letters. So that's the last book I read. But the last book I read like leisurely um, was the Hunger Games books. Oh my gosh, I read those over Christmas break. I love those so much. Um, the book you're currently reading. Currently, I am, well, I'm not currently, but I know it's the next book I'm going to have to read is for that same class, and it's, y'all have probably heard of it. It's called Roll of Thunder, Hear My Cry. I know that we read it whenever I was in school, like fifth or sixth grade, so some of y'all probably read it, so that's the book I'm fixing to start reading because I have some homework to do on it. So, 33 is the last show you watched. The last show I watched was Scandal last night. Oh my gosh. Please tell me if any of y'all watch Scandal because I absolutely love it. And I'm not going to tell you what happened in case you're not caught up. But something big happened on last night's episode, which was the 13th of March. Oh my gosh. I want next week to be here so bad because I want to know what happened at the end. It was the very last thing that happened. And I want to know what it was. So. Favorite food. My favorite food would probably be Mexican. I love Mexican food and Italian. And I love pizza. And I love sweets. And that is so bad that I love sweets, but I do. And I'm not really a meat eater. I really like um, more vegetable stuff. 
but I like chicken, but I don't really like beef or anything. I'm really not a vegetarian by any means, but I do like my chicken, but not really beef or anything. A place you want to visit, I want to go to Bora Bora so bad, and I'm probably never going to go there because it's probably expensive to get a little hut out in the middle of the ocean and just do nothing all day, but I really would love to go there. And I would also love to go to Washington, D.C. because I really like history and I would love to visit all the monuments and see all the historical stuff. That would be really fun. Um, the last place you were, well, not counting at my house, um, I went to eat with some of my friends last night at Olive Garden. So I guess, oh, that, and I went to the mall after that, so probably the mall, but do you have a crush Yes, on my boyfriend. Um, last time you kissed someone. Probably last Sunday. Yep, last Sunday when I said bye to William. Um, last time you were insulted. I don't really think I've ever been, I don't know. I don't think I have the following on YouTube yet to be insulted, like, for people to say mean things to me like in comments or whatever, but I don't think anybody's insulted me in person. Favorite flavor of sweet is chocolate. I love chocolate. I get chocolate ice cream, chocolate milkshakes, chocolate anything, chocolate cake. Love chocolate so much. What instruments do you play? Um, none. Favorite piece of jewelry? Well, I have a few. I actually forgot one, so hold on. Usually, if girls are married, they say their wedding bands, which would probably be mine if I was married, but I'm not. So, I have four. Um, this ring right here, my boyfriend, William, got for me. I keep saying my boyfriend, but William got for me um, for Christmas two years ago. So, I always wear this. And then this ring, uh, my parents got for me for my 21st birthday in November. So, this has become one of my favorites as well. It's a blue topaz um, gemstone with some diamonds around it. So pretty. And then I also love my swatch watch that I got from New York that I mentioned earlier. This is like one of my favorite pieces because I just love it because I got it in New York. And then also this watch that I got for Valentine's Day from William. It's a fossil watch and he did so good. I did not even know he was getting me anything like this. I did not know what he was getting me, but he did so good. So those are my four pieces of jewelry that are my favorites. Last sport you played. I haven't played a sport in so long. I played basketball in high school. I know, it was so terrible. <laughs> and I played softball, but I would have to say that um, basketball is the last sport I've played. Last song you sang. That would have to be last night when we were coming home from town, from, um, from the mall, and we were singing, we were singing crazy. We were singing Heart of Dixie by Cassidy Pope, I think. Oh my gosh, it was so hilarious because we were all singing off key, and it was just really funny. 47 is favorite chat up line. I don't know. I don't have one. I've never used one. And it says, have you ever used it? No. Last time you hung out with someone last night when we all went to eat. We went to the mall. It was really fun. And then the last question is who should answer these questions? And obviously everybody should. So yeah, if you make one of these videos, tell me and I'll come watch it because that would be fun. I love videos where you get to know everybody a little bit more. So yes, I know this is probably going to be a really long video, but I'm going to try for it not to be. So yeah, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel as well because I would love to gain more lovely subscribers. So yeah, I guess that'll be all for today. So I hope that you enjoyed and I will talk to you soon. Bye.